Can you talk about shadow work? Very interested in learning more. So my experience with shadow work was mostly um, it's so it's like we all have this like like an animal type side like uh, like every person is capable of doing monstrous things like how however you think that you are this peaceful person that's something we need to strive for but we we everyone has a survival instinct everyone has a capacity to do harm to another person it's it's just that we keep it at bay we keep the sword sheathed and we don't use it and shadow work is basically um are you are you acknowledging all the asp so a shadow work shadow so think of shadow as like your physical shadow where you walk and there is this dark part that's c coming behind you that's like a reflection of you when so this is my shadow so let's let's say here you see how there's a shadow on the wall and it's following me wherever i go and most of the time um you can't really uh you walk in front but you have to kind of turn around to see it so a shadow 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 side is also something that you don't see it's almost like you have to take the the blockers off your peripheral vision to see so it's not something you look at directly not not all the time and it's not easy to look at directly so your shadow is basically your unconscious part it's basically your uh, your conscious your body consciousness that does things and acts a certain way without your conscious input and shadow work is examining in what areas of your life are you making conscious decisions and in what areas of your life are you making decisions where it's just an impulse and you're like a shadow work has a lot to do with trauma it, it has a lot to do with some past experience where you uh became fragmented in a sense so something happened let, let's say for example something happened in your childhood where uh, you wanted where you got bullied or you got emotionally um, manipulated or something happened to you where in that moment when it happened your first instinct was to go you're not gonna do this to me get away and then get away from the person and push the person away or or leave the relationship or you instinctively wanted to throw a tantrum because it was actually the thing that would protect you but you didn't you got stuck you got stuck in this freeze response and you said to yourself i'm not this person that's edgy that uh that lashes on to people while in reality that was very that was a natural response for you to push a bully away to say to a person you're not gonna manipulate me you didn't stand up for yourself and then later, I, I'm speaking this not as patriotism, I'm speaking, speaking this from somebody that was in those situations and had to go through them and realized through shadow work that you need to have this other side. You need to have this sharp sharpness to you. Not always, not always, not to everyone, but when it's needed, you need to have a sword. And then if you go through life with this with this aspect of yourself uh, unconscious un, unaccepted unintegrated then every time you feel that you want to stand up for yourself and you want to say this to somebody and it's basically boundaries i don't i'm not letting you do this to me if you don't do that you are 
repressing your shadow and then the shadow comes out in other areas where it's inappropriate if you don't stand up to a boss or a co-worker you're gonna come home and you're gonna uh, spill all that fire onto your onto your wife you're gonna spill all that fire onto your children and that's where shadow work comes comes in it comes in when you need to uh, slowly go into your subconscious and see where your body is actually pushing you to, to get it out and not be it's not, it's not that it's nothing is that easy but it's basically looking at your day-to-day -day movement your day-to-day -day breathing your day-to-day -day emotions basing on certain things and saying looking at okay it's basically examining yourself in as many uh, areas as many situations as you can to see where you want to be peaceful but something is boiling inside of you why is it because of the person or is it because it the the situation in front of you is reminding you of the situation 10 years ago when you wanted to say no but you didn't say no and now it's reoccurring 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 and shadow work is making the shedding light on all these areas in your life where you are repressing all these things you want to express them but you're not doing it so that's shadow work it's we all have a conscious side and a non-conscious side that's where human design is very helpful it can it can show you in what areas you are mostly success susceptible to outside influence to outside conditioning you, you can check which energy centers might carry the not self or the shadow self theme uh, human design is, is an amazing tool for shadow work amazing tool I'll get some tea and put the lights on and I'll be back we're here for another 40 minutes I create lines here welcome to the channel subscribe like join the community ask questions in the comments and feel free to share your story my one-on-one -on -one sessions In these sessions, you get my undivided attention and energy and an opportunity to ask personal and in-depth questions. I offer one-on-one -on -one personal human design readings. These sessions are a direct transmission of my knowledge and hands-on experience with human design. On this call, we take a look at your chart and explain everything along the way. These sessions can change your whole life in a few hours and reprogram old beliefs. You will meet your true self for the first time and get practical tools how to trust, navigate and make decisions from your intuition. You can get a two hour reading, a one hour basic reading, or you can take advantage of the discount bundle, buy four and pay for three. I offer one-on-one -on -one personal psychotherapy. These sessions are an open and safe container for you to feel seen heard and understood promoting well-being and a pressure-free living I can hold space and give advice in many areas of expertise including shadow work trauma support somatic body balancing the five elements in the body energy work 
and an abundance of other modalities. You can book one hour sessions or also take advantage of the discount bundle, buy four and pay for three. I offer three audio courses, Human Design Basics, Human Design Intermediate and Elemental Balancing. Human Design Basics is aimed at those who are new and want to get started. It covers the basics about the four energy types, the generator, projector, manifester and reflector it goes into the basics of each of the nine centers and each of the 12 profiles perfect for those who want bite-sized information that they can listen to on the go human design intermediate is aimed at those who have completed the basics or those who already have some general understanding and would like to dive deeper. It has much more detailed knowledge about each of the energy types and specifically their strategy. It explains all of the centers and the nuances between the defined centers and the open ones. It also explains all the different authorities. The Elemental Balancing course teaches you about Earth, Water, Air, Fire, and Ether. If you're feeling too fiery and angry, too airy, overthinking and nervous, maybe too heavy, depressed and sluggish, or too emotional, this course is for you. Also, if you're feeling you lack passion and fire, you lack inspiration, you lack grounding or emotional expression, this course is for you. You can download my three books for free. They are called Initiation into Human Design, Etheric Drops 1 and 2. Initiation into Human Design is a guidebook that comes with the basics course and etheric drops are collections of thoughts, rhymes and reminders that I have written across, 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 across <laughs> in the last few years. If you have the Insight Timer app, you can follow me there and join my live sessions. I do weekly and daily movement classes for stress release. I also do question and answer sessions about human design and holistic healing. Come and join us in the supportive community. No taboos, no judgment, nothing is off limits. Learn, get support and chill out. All the offers mentioned are available at iCreateLines.com Until next time, peace, health, and abundance.